Hello everybody and welcome to the casting of Frank Stone. Now this is a game by Supermassive Games and they have quite the track record. They have made games like Until Dawn, which I think is their best game to date. Um, they've also made The Quarry, they made the Dark Pictures um, Little Hope game as well. And now this one, and this one is getting quite a bit of traction on YouTube right now as we speak. I think quite a lot of YouTubers have played it. Um, it's a pretty short game to my knowledge, it's about four hours long I believe. And it is centered around film. Um, I think the general story is that some kids made a movie in a haunted mill and it is still kind of terrorizing them like 50 years down the track. But no more talking, let's get into the game. Okay, slide the thing until the image is barely visible. That's not gonna be very fun for you guys though. So maybe let's make it let's make it pretty visible just so that you don't um so that you don't kind of miss out on anything. Die alone or die together? What does that mean? Um, I'm gonna press Oh, so this can this game can be multiplayer. That's quite interesting, but we're gonna go die alone. New game. New save. You will not escape torment, but you may survive. You'll witness suffering, but survival is expected. Leave behind all hope of survival. We're gonna go with the most easy difficulty just because I do know myself. I know that I struggle quite a bit with games. Not the best at them, which is ironic considering I am a gaming YouTuber. Every choice made, every action taken has consequences. Some will save lives. Some will result in death. Ooh, okay, interesting. I'm digging the I've typewriter everything aesthetic. For it. A world within a story whispered to me centuries ago. Oh, you a witch? of a timeless power, infinite in knowledge, voracious in hunger, the entity, a realm so close to ours but always out of reach, until I found him, Frank Stone. Okay, my interesting. My killer. I am Augustine Lieber, and I'm about to change our worlds forever. Whoa. Oh god, what's this? Hey, I'm an animal. That's a baby. Hunt for missing infant continues. So babies are gone missing then. Oh, there's a copper. Set a steel corporation. So this is a steel mill. The Burning Moor, Cedar Hill Mill, 1963. Okay, we're not in black and white anymore, which is great. Oh, 
Oh, that was snoring. I thought that was the dog growling, but I was so confused. So we're playing as Sam. I'm assuming you're the night watchman here. I am. Or just you? Covering the entire site? Oh no. I got help. Where are they now? On duty? Of a manor. Merlin just goes where he pleases. Merlin. A dog. Doberman Pincher. Best friend a fella could ask for. Loyal to the seventh horn sounds. Trust him more than I trust myself. Serious, I need to ask you a few questions or concerned. You and the dog are the security for the mill. Um, let's go serious. We're here for a reason. I need to ask you a few questions. I'm yours to dispose of. Can I have your name? Thomas Jefferson Holt. Call me Tom. Officer Sam Green. Tom, I want to talk to you about... I know what about. That missing boy, right? That's right. You think he could be missing here? This mill looks a big place. Biggest in all Cedar Hills. But that don't make no difference. Ain't no funny business going on around here. Not undermining Merlin's noses. Skeptical sounds like a lot of ground to cover, or can I check your records? Let's be curious. You sound confident. And rightly so. Can okay. I check your records? I don't want to offend this dude. No records? The logbook, visitors to the mill, out of our shifts, that sort of thing. All right, right. Uh, well, gotta be here someplace. Is that it? Uh, it's okay. Allow me. Discovery. I see. He's a drunk. Ooh, someone's been faking the entry, so that's what we've discovered. Um, also, the graphics are kind of wigging out, and I'm a little bit nervy. Someone's been faking the entries. No. Who? Oh. I'm guessing you, Tom. Me? Well, maybe your partner Merlin helps you. Sounds like he's expected to pick up all your slack. It ain't like that. I don't do it for me. I just got to cover for some of the mother fellas now and then. The ones who won't sign in or out. Got any names for me? Well, uh, what is it now? Hank, maybe? Oh, oh no, 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 no. Fred something. Frank. Yeah, that's it. Fred's, Fred some. Come on, Tom. It's Frank. I'm sorry, Sam. I don't remember. Alcohol does tend to impair the memory. That what you come out here for? To give a veteran a hard time about his medicinal practices? No. I'm here because a child is missing. And every minute wasted is another chance gone to find him. Boy, you ain't gonna find him here. I'd know it in my bones if that boy were within a mile of this mill. Mm -mm, no, you wouldn't. I'd like to take a look around. Let's be insistent. I'm not even gonna read the stone. All the same. I'd like to take a look around. You want to do my job for me? Be my guest. Hmm. Thank you for your help, Tom. I know the baby's Happy here. To oblige. I heard it crying. Cedar Lakes lure him in. Guaranteed for a lifetime. Why did it pan to that? Is he a fisherman? Is he gonna sacrifice the babies in the lake? Okay, this is a very interesting start to the game. I didn't think that it'd uh, start like this. I'm definitely hooked. You got a baby crying and there's also a baby missing and now we're in a will. We're in a will, we're in a mill. Uh, yeah, we need to watch out for that bloody dog. Because I don't think that it's on old mate's side. I think that it's on the baby killer's side. Objective, find a way into the mill. Wow, look at this, man. This looks great. I mean, it's to be expected from a company as big as these guys are. I just don't know if my PC can handle it. So if it's a bit laggy, I am sorry. I mean, if it's too laggy, I'll just never post this video. Which is unfortunate, because I would really like to. 
Okay, so that's the entrance then. Where's the dog? Where's our friend? Is there anything? Is that the way in? I can get through there. No, come on. This way. A hey, to squeeze. Don't get caught by the dog when you're trying to squeeze through, mate. Wouldn't end well for you. I don't know if I'm missing stuff right now. Like, I don't know if I've just, like, straight up found the way in. Or if this is a secret. Oh, this is a secret. What's this? R2 to open. A chess piece. She promised to take away my pain. Take away my nightmares. Trinket found. So there are trinkets to find. Interesting. That was cool. That's a really cool concept. It's like a little collectible that we've got going on. Can I go in here? Can I break the window? No. That's fine. Nothing else is in here though. Okay, interesting. So, what was that? Like, whose trinket is it and who was the person talking about? Maybe Frank Stone is in cahoots with that witch that we saw right at the start, which is what I think. What the hell was that? Also, mate, why are you alone? Buddy, let me... Okay, I can never see their faces in this game. I want to look at him in the face and ask him why he is alone. I know it's like the graveyard shift and all, but like... I feel like if you're investigating a dead baby, you maybe... What is that? Like, what are they saying? Is that the man from inside that we just spoke to? Can I hustle? I can hustle. Look at me hustling. Is he calling for his dog so that he can sick him on me? No entry, staff only. Well, I'm a police officer, not to not to boast or anything, but I'm pretty sure I'd be allowed in. The window. Where? I can get in through there. Where? Where? There it is. Okay, sick. I don't think there are going to be any more trinkets in the game this early. Um. This could be a stretch, but there is a cloth hanging over this. And there was a cloth hanging over the other thing. This is huh. ghetto as hell. Search Easy for the missing it. child. Okay, well, just listen out and you'll hear it screaming its lungs out, because that's what it was doing before. Okay. Telephone, are you going to ring? A stereotypical horror game? Okay. Where are you, baby? I really don't want to find a dead baby. That would be really, really, really upsetting. It'd be cool if we could see something in the distance. Okay, are we in? Are we, like, in, in? Am I gonna find a pile of dead babies anywhere? I really hope not. I shouldn't laugh about that. I'm so sorry. Oh, God. Nothing in this little hidey hole? Do you know how to wield your flashlight, mate? Just out of curiosity, because that was terrible. Poor form. Very poor form. Okay, I don't think that there's anything else around here. This area is 147.3, and 142.5. What time is it? Five past nine. I'm gonna have to fight a dog and I'm not excited. Okay, is there anything like... I'm too used to playing The Last of Us where you've got to look at all of this junk and pick up screws and stuff. You guys, if you're watching this, should also totally go and watch my playthrough of The Last of Us. You will not be able to return to the area. Good thing I'm not going that way then. What's this? Friday the 13th. How fitting. Afternoon, 2 o'clock till 10 o'clock. Harold Norris, Dennis McCannon, McCann, Bobby Rivers, Frank Stone, and Lou Osterman. Graveyard shift, 10 till 6, N-A. So, from 10 till 6, there's just no one here? Because it's not quite 10 o'clock, because I would have been like, oh, he's not meant to be here, but it's not quite 10 o'clock, so that's fine. Alrighty, now we'll, we'll continue. Wait, what can I examine? This. Let's open, let's open her up, man. Oh. Huh? Huh? What does this say? Employee's personal record, February 4th. Surname, preferred name, T E F A. T E. It's not, it's not Frank Stone, is it? No, yeah, it is Frank Stone. 
date of birth the 14th of the 17th 1927 so he's a machinist address single single house city he was criminal record one charge of assault and robbery uh temporarily released maybe three five dreams habilitation sponsor or main contact you've got a doctor so you're meant to be in contact with someone mr frank stone star file whoa a worker star file but the name is botched out how many workers at the mill have criminal records like this i wonder relics relationships i don't have any relationship yet but i do have a fate interesting that's similar like in until dawn um move it in until dawn the uh totems like told you your fate Whoa. Okay, so I wasn't even in the mill just yet. That's insane. Can I go in here? Or are you rusted shut? No, you just- that's just not a part that the game wants me to go in. Okay, that's fine. What about in here? I want the trinkets now. I feel like I'm, um, a little bit of a perfectionist in that- in that respect. Hello? I want to get all the trinkets. Anyone here? Already running, babe. It's police! Yeah, and you're without backup as well, because you're a very smart cookie, you are. <gasps> oh, this game can get screwed. Of all the moments for the light bulb to burst, you do it right then and there, because of course you do. Can't go in there? No? Okay, it definitely wants me to go into this bright red building, but I want to see if there's any other trinkets. For my stuff, for my collecting. Okay, nope. In we go. Ooh, the textures are all over the joint. That zoom in is really cool when you enter a new area. Who's there? The dog, mate. Whip your gun out. Think twice. The best safety measure is a mindful worker. Keep your workers safe. That dog is eating something, but what? Ugh, smells like death. Yeah, dead babies. Really hope not. That would be... All kinds of messed up. Can I jump this? Oh yeah. Superhero move. Oh god, I didn't want to go into this. It's only been two minutes. Hey. Mister. That's Officer Green. Sure. You haven't seen Merlin, have you? No. Yeah. Sorry. Ah. You alright there? Ugh. Yeah, it's just... Jesus, you don't smell that? <sighs> Sniffer's out of commission. <laughs> Got a little too up close and personal with a can of mustard gas back in the trenches. <laughs> mm. Ugh. It can be a blessing in disguise. Ugh. Gotta find out where it's coming from. What's it smell like? Death. Nothing good. No. Yeah. Death would have been a cooler line to say, I'm just saying. Okay. Forward. Yep. There's your dog, mate. And he's eating babies. Eesh. Merlin! There you are, boy. We wondered where you got to. <gasps> Liked it if you two made proper acquaintance. Okay, not babies. God damn it. But something. Ooh, why are you touching it? What are you, why are you touching it? You put this out for him? No. It looks like someone else has found his way to your boy's heart. Through his stomach. It ain't possible. Merlin and me, we're a team. No, you're not, mate. Who'd want to come between a man and his best friend? Someone who can use your best friend. What's that? Some kind of wiener mate? That's a human ear. That's what that is. Um, it's giving me the R option, and I don't know what the R is. 
unless it's this. It was this. It's an ear. We know it's an ear. You're touching a human ear. Will you look at that? That damn dog. Why are you just like handling Think that, that like nothing? To the boy you're looking for? It's too big. There's no proof it does. It came from someone else. Yeah. Nah. Came from someone much older. A mm -hmm. Teenager, maybe. Jesus, married a milkmaid. <laughs> hey, you know about any other folks going missing in Cedar Hills lately? Well, I don't know. Who would know a thing like that? Well, somebody does. You, like, it was in a barrel as well. There's there's a lot of it. You're not going to notice that it was in a barrel that the dog knocked over? That's probably why it smells so bad. This is creepy as hell. They chose a good spot to, um, like, to host a horror movie, I guess. Okay. What was that sound? Yeah, buddy, what was that sound? You'd know. Stay behind me. Huh. Can you please draw your gun? You are freaking me out. Okay. Oh, cutscene. My god, I was ready to fight. Someone down there? So, what is this thing? The grate? Yeah, <gasps> what is it for? <laughs> it's, uh, for the furnace, I think. You don't know for sure? Yeah, I work at the mill, not in the mill. Hmm. Find something to pry open the grate. Interesting. Okay. So we're looking for a crowbar of sorts. Or something similar. Can I get in here? I can climb this, and then I can see the cloths. The cloths are helpful. Oh, the graphics are wigging out. What's this? That's like, why is that? Okay. Hey, hey, look. Pick up. Gotcha. That'll work. Gotcha. Some items can be kept and used later. You mean that I can bang this dude's head with a crowbar? Okay, up we go. Up and over. Okay, so... Whoa. That's not good. Bit glitchy. So if I, like... Keep it, and if I go to other areas, I can... I can open them? Stand back. Press X repeatedly before the time runs out. I don't like that. That's a new sort of quick time that I'm not familiar with. Come on, muscles. To be fair, that shit is heavy. It's like manhole covers are also really heavy. Don't hurt your back, bro. Just tell him you're coming, why don't you? You're being so noisy. Hmm. All right. Take this. Use the radio in my car and call the station. Hell where, yeah. Where are you going? You, you really think that boy's down there? I don't know. Ew, the floor's wet. feeling, and it's not a good feeling. That's so uncomfy. I don't like that. I'm gonna need you to take this too. Make sure the sheriff gets this. <sighs> Oh boy, I don't know. Supportive, I need your help here. Let's be supportive. This man could use a little support. I need your help here, Tom. I wouldn't ask if I didn't. I just don't know if I'm made of this stuff, buddy. You're a they veteran. don't call it a higher calling for nothing. You gotta rise to meet it. You can do this. There's so much detail in his eyebrows. I'm sorry, that's so weird for me to notice. Yeah. I can do this. Yeah, you can, buddy. Go on. Hey. I'm counting on you, Tom Hope.
you put your faith in Tom, so my fate changed, that makes it sound like a bad idea. Like I put my fate in the wrong person. Do I not have enough fate or faith to give to anyone else? <laughs> have I run out of faith? Oh my god, be quiet. Is this stressing anyone else out or like just me? I was under the impression that this game was set in. <laughs> Oof. Set in the future of this game, like of this part, but maybe not. This is a long intro. Mmm, the rats are lovely. And yeah, good luck getting back out of there, mate. I mean, I know you've- oh fuck me, this thing's massive! This thing is massive and I don't like it. Furnace access, that's cool, but we're looking for trinkets. Which means that we go other ways. Okay, this way. Furnace access, I know. See, like, look. Would've walked straight past this. <gasps> trinkets! Trinkets! What does this one say? I know what it is to believe. Through the forest, the path is clear and the fire waits for me. Interesting. Okay. Surely there's only one in this area, though. I'm pretty sure. Eesh. What is down here? Is this area just nothing? Can I get trapped in here? I didn't really think about that. What if someone's behind me? No one is behind me. Okay, this area was kind of useless then. Is there another trinket? No, this is the trinket that I just got. Okay. I'm kind of good with what I've explored so far, so we are going to continue onwards. To this way, to the furnace access. Which is through here. Wait, wait, wait. I so I'm sorry, I could examine something. I need to... What could I examine? This. Symbols. Oh. Someone's engraved strange rituals in the hidden... Whatever, I didn't read it in time. But the game read it, which is good. The game took down that I saw that. Furnace access that way as well. Yeesh, this is a creepy spot, guys. Okay. This has got to be it. Does it? This way. They put that truck there so that I don't go that way because I physically, I can't squeeze through. Yeah, it doesn't give me the option to squeeze through, so... I mean... Where does that go? Are we, like, right by the mill? Furnace access. Furnace access, I guess. Why is everything down? Uh, this place turns my stomach. Yeah, man, same. Do I have to crawl through that? I do. That's so not fun. <sighs> my god. <sighs> Goddamn small spaces. Yeah. <sighs> Ooh, yuck. You can keep that. I don't like the industrial noises. It's creeping me out. What is that? That's got blood on it. I know that much. My god. What? Pick it up. It's evidence. You're a shit officer. I wasn't even meant to come this way. My bad. So what way do I go then? Uh, through here? Squeeze, buddy, squeeze. Oh, oh, shit. oh. Shit. I didn't know that I... That was terrible. That was horrifying. Sorry, bro. Okay, we're without a flashlight. That's so much fun. Okay, no one's over there. Anything in here? Can't go in there, no. That's so fine. We love it here. I see how is this a furnace? This is such a big area. Okay. Uh I can move something. What can I move? There we go. Okay, up we go. Oh 
Hurry up. I'm not digging the red lighting, you guys. I'm really not. Whoa, that looks evil as hell. This is hellish. Yeah. I can hear a baby crying. Son of a fuck. <laughs> Crip. Go, get the baby. What was that? Do you not see that? I think that I might have just fucked myself. Why aren't you hustling, man? Okay, that was fine. I didn't see the ladder. Oh. See, I knew what to do that time. Mm -hmm. Who the fuck are you, man? Who the heck are you? Stop! Oh god, use R to aim and press R2 on the target, okay. Where where are we aiming, man? Oh. There. That's an interesting mechanic. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. You are he's so emotionless. Oh, you're a dickhead. But your gun's right there, isn't it, buddy? Pick up your gun, please. Please pick up your gun. Pick up your gun. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. I still haven't quite grasped these mechanics. That's hot as hell, isn't it? Oh, he stabbed me through something. I thought that I was stuck to it. Oh god, guys, this is so messed up. Come on, buddy. Oh, <laughs> yuck. Ooh, you freed yourself from the pipe, so my fate's been changed. Yeah, that means that I survived. Oh my god, hurry up before he throws the baby into the damn fire. Oof, you creepy dude. Oh, there's a witch up there. Oh god, okay. I just, I did not know that I'd have to do that. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Where's your adrenaline, my guy? My adrenaline is crazy high right now. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No, 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 no. Do not let the baby be killed. Please, 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 please. Thank you. Thank you, out of boy. You shot Frank Stone and saved the child. The fate is sealed. Interesting. Okay, well. <laughs> His jaw's been ripped off. That's so disgusting. Sleep tight, motherfucker. Oh yeah, cool line, my guy. Okay, let's hope putting my fate in this dude hasn't fucked me up. Can you wake up? Ugh, yuck. What is that? What's it doing? Why is it? Is it raising or am I going crazy? It's not raising. I thought the fire was raising. See how black the smoke is? That's gotta be a symbolism for something. And that looks like teeth. There's stuff floating there. That was creepy. Savior, Sam stopped Frank Stone. That was messed up. Hey, babe. Wakey, wakey. Polzig. What's that? And who are you? It's okay. It's okay. Why are you sleeping in a jacket? Okay. <sighs> 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 
So is she dreaming about it? Is she a psychic? Whoa, she's something. <laughs> I don't know what she is, but she's something. Uh, you're not gonna, you're not gonna talk about that, babe? No, that's just normal for you? Okay. Who's this? Is this Wee Mama? Mom. Yes, it is. You say it like she's dead. Maybe she's dead. That would be sad. Unfortunate. Um, why do you live in the middle of the woods, babe? Oh, mm -hmm. that was creepy. Okay, so she's definitely dead. Where? Like, okay. Okay, am I back that in my bedroom? Right. I am back in my bedroom. Oh, is that still the same? Nope, her face has been all sorts of scratched up. Uh, you're not gonna say anything? Someone scratched your mom's face up, babes. You just don't really care about that? Is there anything here that I can expect? I can pick something up. Did someone drug it? Is there anything on the bottom? I can't look at the bottom? Okay. That's fine. Is this still the intro? I haven't seen like a chapter two or anything like that. Baby girl, slow. Oh, the... oh this is so trippy. Oh god, okay. This is so trippy. This is really cool. Mum, slow the hell down, please. Her face is even more scratched up. This is just going to keep repeating until her face is like gone. Is it not? Can I also pick up the water again? Is the roof still... Yep. Still all sorts of messed up. The cup still looks normal. Why? <laughs> look, look at her ribs. <laughs> okay. Time to be serious. Her mum is walking away from her in a dream. Very traumatic stuff. A flashlight would be great. Oh, we're outside now. How lovely. And... Yep, perfect. Just a door frame in the middle of nowhere. Oh, why am I why am I red? Why am I red? That is terrifying. Why am I you you okay, she's got nothing to say about this. Yeah, look look you you're red. The the earth is just turning red underneath you and you just don't really care. Maybe she has these sort of dreams often. I can't run, which is frustrating because I I'm a speedy gal, but that's fine. Time to squeeze again. Oh look, the ground went normal. Squeeze. Squeeze. Is that meant to sound like a heartbeat or not? Is this... Okay, where are we? This looks like the woods that the witch was in right at the start of the game. Turn on. Oh, there's someone behind me. Mom? What's wrong? Is this purgatory? This is not your mother. I'm here. Everything's all right. She sounds demonic. Ah! Ew, that looks like a spider. What the heck? You got an empty fight, girl. You're lucky. Okay, there's a man behind her, but still. She got a whole row to herself. Get a grip. Yeah, girl, get a grip. Who are you? What's your name? Okay, what's that? The key to it all, I'm guessing. Oh, God. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Okay, I turned off the copyrighted music, so this one should be okay. I really hope that it is. 
I mean, I don't have to worry about that just yet. While the night winds wait. Whoa, this is cool. is a woman so I'm more inclined to stop. That was a that's a really interesting quick time. Black veil. The music situation is real funny right now. The stop and the start all the time. Uh, hi. <clears throat> so uh you need a lift? Reynolds got a flat. Oh you're American. Yeah. So am I. Okay. <laughs> cool. Yeah so do you mind giving me a lift? Right, sure, of course. You can drop me off at Garrett Manor. It's just a few miles up the road. Huh, weird. That's actually where I'm going, too. Huh. So it's not out of your way. Uh, Interesting. It's not. See, that scares me. I chose to pick up the hitchhiker. That scares me. I don't know who this lady is now. What if she kills me? But we're going to the same place. I don't know why we're going there. It's the first that I've ever heard about some manor. So we're both going to the same place, huh? What are the odds of that? <laughs> yeah. I mean, I guess it's not all that odd, seeing as, you know, we're already pretty close. And I don't think this road goes anywhere else. So, did you say you were going to Garrett Manor for business, or...? I did not. Oh. So, um, where are you from? From? Like, where do you live? Paris. That's where I'm from, currently. Before that, I was from Amsterdam, Dublin, Milan, Los Angeles... Damn! ...and Oregon, once upon a time. That's cool. Hey, my mom's from Oregon. Well, one of them is. I always heard it was really nice. Or kind of a shithole, but like a really nice kind of shithole. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't know anyway because I've never been. I'm a big apple girl, born and raised. Barely even made it north of 14th Street before going off to college. Here in England? Uh, no, Berlin, actually. Oh, I'm Maddie, by the way. Linda. It's nice to meet you, Maddie. Yeah, you too. Introduced Even if herself I was worried, you as might Linda? try to clonk me. Ah, uh, sorry. What do you do for a living? What do you know about this manor? Let's go like that. So, what do you know about this manor we're both coincidentally going to? Hmm. What do you know about it? <laughs> Hold on now, that's not fair. I asked you first. Okay, well, I don't know anything, and I'm guessing neither do you. Mm, I didn't say I didn't know anything. Yeah, you did. <laughs> you could tell. Kinda. Yeah. <laughs> All I know is that I was invited for a personal audience with Augustine Lieber, and that that was supposed to be super fancy or something, and that it would be in my best interest not to turn it down. Huh. What? My invitation was pretty much the same. Hmm. Linda is grateful you pulled over. Okay, sick. Um, that name is the same as the witch. She introduced herself as Augustine. Hey. Take a look. So it's already been predestined that she is evil as heck. Which worries me slightly. You've come to the end of the rainbow. Ooh, automatic gates, fancy. If I could live in a massive mansion away from society, you bet your ass I would. Chapter two in the House of Darkness, Gurant, Gurant, 
Geraint Manor, 2024. So this is based in the present. Interesting. Okay, well, we're here. That's cool. This place would be staffed and secured 20... Were the last not on, like, five this minutes ago? This is definitely a little too, uh... On the nose? <laughs> I was gonna say a little too much like a horror movie. Exactly. The irony is staring at you in the face. So, um, do we just knock, or...? I'm not sure. Oh, I... doorbell. That's a creepy ass doorbell, and those things are what we saw rip her mum away. Maybe nobody's home. Well, this is definitely when I was told to get here. That's a red flag. Me too. That should be red flag Hello? number one. Anybody home? Hmm. It's a good rule of thumb to try every door. No, you think? Well, they're expecting us, aren't they? No way is it. Huh. It's just open. Just go in? Why are you asking me? Because you're a grown up. <laughs> so are you, Maddie. <sighs> then, uh, here we go. Mm -hmm. Apparently. You gotta like that. Not a fan. Why are all the lights off? Beats me. Madison Hello? 911 entrance hall. Let's take a look around. Um. Hello? Look around and find Augustine. Okay, I will do that in two seconds, but for now, I am going to leave this part here. We got past the first chapter, onto the second chapter. I think that I'll keep the parts as long as the chapters are. Um, I am trying to currently cut my content down to be about half an hour long, but my guess is that this is way over half an hour. Um, but we've, we've gotten into it, we've done the intro, we kind of learnt who Frank Stone is. He was a baby killer and he was working for this lady, Augustine, and now we're in her creepy, creepy haunted mansion, which is so much fun. Um, I've got no idea what to expect from this game either, but I'm thoroughly impressed so far. So I really hope that you guys follow me along and play the game with me. So as always, thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And I will see you in the next part. Bye!